Huge day lined up today, guys. Had a uh, epic running day today in the gym. Full dynamic warm up. Um, I'm lucky that uh, the place I go, the gym, has 50 yards of turf, and I'm able to do pretty much everything and anything I need to. Um, gonna give you a little tour of my workout. Like I said before, if you guys want more in depth workout stuff, you let me know. I, I got a tweet today about more in depth food, talk about what I eat, my diet. And I'm gonna do that for you. Uh, stay tuned and uh, I'll get to that. Here's my workout. You're doing quite a bit of running, so we wanna make sure the muscles are loose, get the blood flow there. And we're gonna do that with this. Self myofascial release, gonna get after it, let's go. rolling out got some self my fascial release in now we want to stretch it before our dynamic warm-up don't stretch too long just get the blood flowing Hold out, stretched out feeling a little bit looser now it's time for the full dynamic warm-up muscle activation, mobility, technique, all rolled into one. You see the cones behind me. It's gonna be 30 yards, uh, most of things, three times each. Let's see what happens. So guys, that was my warm up. Took about 40 minutes, fully warmed up. Got a nice sweat going. Now I gotta get my amino acids in during the workout. Change of direction today, check it out.
joke, did some power, acceleration, some med ball tosses into some acceleration work, change of direction work with the cones, forward, backward, lateral. Finished off with some, uh, as you could see, some bear crawls, some crab walks. In that body durable, let's go. After the workout, obviously I'm feeling good. The blood's flowing, the endorphins are going. So uh, this is what my Snapchat followers get after pretty much every workout, a super hyped Bill O'Brien. You know, oftentimes I hear people say, Bill, you got too much energy. No such thing, baby. No such thing, let's go. Fired up for today, baby. It is Wednesday. What you doing today? What you doing today? Let's go. Let's go. Get better. You got to excuse me. I'm all fired up because I just crushed a running workout. Feeling good. Feeling real good. Feeling real, 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 real. Obviously, when you're too hyped, things are going to come up. Things are going to pop up. Try to bring you down. Don't think like that, people. I walk in the crib, a.k.a. TBL headquarters, and uh, we're having our, uh, our annual fire drill due to breakfast cooking. Check it out. Never a dull day in the TBL headquarters, a.k.a. Thrills Crib. As you can hear, fire alarm. During the fire drill, I, what I do is I make some eggs. I made three cage-free eggs, um, and I also had a side of fermented vegetables, a.k.a. sauerkraut. I use rainbow kraut because it's like purple cabbage, regular cabbage. Uh, fermented vegetables are obviously really good for the gut. Uh, you don't want to overdo it though, but uh, if your digestive tract's running at prime optimal levels, then you're going to be able to absorb the nutrients of the food that you put in the body. So keep that in mind. Big fan of kombuchas, big fan of um, fermented vegetables, all helping the gut and getting, uh, getting those nutrients into the body. Had a lovely, lovely lunch meeting today. I wouldn't call it a lunch meeting, but a lunch date rather, with my bro, Curtis Kong, and uh, my lovely, lovely mother at our favorite spot, Core. Beautiful family. For the tweeter, Laura Daniels, that I got today um, about my diet, the reason I eat foods that um, least processed as possible. I try to eat foods um, that, such as for carbohydrates, I'll have sweet potatoes, quinoa, rice. Uh, for protein, I'm gonna have my cage-free eggs, my antibiotic-free chicken, my grass-fed beef, bison, you name it. Big fan of uh, wild salmon, if you can find a good source. Um, and then veggies. I'm a huge fan of pretty much all veggies. And then I add on top of that fermented vegetables, um, because honestly, over time, we've evolved to eat certain foods. Uh, no, I'm not calling this a paleo diet prescription. I'm calling it a whole foods approach. Stay away from preservatives, sugar-laden food, and uh, your body will be able to A, perform, and B, look good. So uh, those are little pointers for you guys out there. If you want more, just let me know. In the office, we were able to finalize some things at TBL. Our schedule for 2017 is coming along pretty nicely. We got some really cool events planned, some things that we've evolved. So we've been in business for three years now. September 2013 was our inception date. Um, been in business three years, been growing every year. But now we're trying to shake things up a bit. Uh, we got some really cool plans for 2017, which excites me a great deal. Um, not your average camp and clinic. We got some we got some things in the works. Don't get it twisted. We evolve. So I'm fired up about that. Fired up about TBL's appearance next week on the 18th in Windsor, Ontario for a, a huge Can-Am Indian Friendship Center event um, in Windsor, Ontario, which should be pretty awesome. Uh, and then I'm obviously really excited about next week for myself. Talked with my GM today, actually GM of the year, Rich Lisk, my man, keep it up, hashtag Lisk Logistics, getting it done in New England um, like no other, so fired up about Rich and, and everything he's accomplishing. Himself, Brett Bucktooth and I, obviously Brett, a lacrosse legend, I talked about him a couple days ago, um, but basically we're going to uh, be heading down to Washington, D.C. 
for a Native Vision uh, event, which is pretty cool to be a part of and represent the NLL and represent the New England Black Wolves at this Native Youth event in Washington, D.C. So I'm pretty fired up about that and excited. Um, and we've got some other things in the works that I can't quite talk about yet. Um, for instance, we got a social media campaign dropping potentially tomorrow. Uh, so keep your eyes peeled on TBL social media and uh, join along. You know, tweet me, shoot me a, a Snapchat, hit me up on Instagram, whatever it may be. Uh, the, uh, the people who are asking me questions, obviously, on Snapchat, Big Eric. Appreciate it, brother. Stay big, bro. He is getting after it every day, and I love it. I've seen him transform um, from, a, from a, a little boy into a man, a big man. So keep it up, brother. Excited to see how you do this season. Big Cole, stay on that grind, bro. Stay on that grind. I'm here. Um, I'm going to clock out of the office today. I don't know where I'm headed tonight, but I'm going to bring you guys along. So uh, feel free to uh, join me. We hit up the mall and guess who we run into? No no other than Heinz Hummer. What up, though? Yo, what's good? What's Gucci? Yeah, buddy. MT. And that's a wrap, people. Good night.